32. Maya is 30. Damian Maya. Okay, you ready? Tiago Alves. Here we go! Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. White trunks for Alves. Black trunks for the champion. Damian Maya, we know, is a Brazilian jiu-jitsu whiz. He's got an outstanding ground game. What we haven't seen tested too much yet is his stand-up game and how he's going to deal with some of the bigger middleweights. Well, he had a real problem when he was standing up against Nate Marquardt, of course, but Nate Marquardt is one of the best in the division uh, and a real, true knockout artist. I think that Damian Maya needs uh, a lot more work on the stand-up aspect of his game. If he thinks he's going to stand in there and bang with guys that have been doing it their whole lives he's not gonna fare any better than if guys who just learned jiu-jitsu think they can go to the ground with him and back up to his feet looking for a takedown he tries to take him down with the single but doesn't get it side control nicely done one overhook one underhook nice brawl Trying to grab the leg, and he does. Takedown by Damian Maya. And Joe, he's one of the best submission specialists to ever fight in the octagon. He escapes, and he's back on his feet. He found a hope for that. And he stuffs another takedown. Looking for the big finishing punch. Good combination. Beautiful right hand. Continuing to strike well. Alves caught by that solid uppercut. Very nicely done. Just over two remain. Trying to take him down again. He's going to try to take the back, I think. Oh, he's got, oh, his, he's got his back. Wow, look at that. How good is that? Uh-oh. He hip escapes. He's out of the full mount. Now he's in guard. Back up to his feet again. Wow, what a powerful leg kick that was. And he's down. Alves with some solid leg kicks. It's a good block, and he counters with the left hook. Very nice timing with these shots here. Joe's opponent clearly wants this fight on the ground, but he can't take him down. One minute remains. Maya gets him in the plum. And he connects to the body. Both men landing in that exchange. Jolo's elbows are vicious, and they're doing a ton of damage. Looking for the single. Oh, and down. He's moved to full guard. Oh, and that'll be the yeah. end of round number one. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. Nesse round você foi bem, mas você não pode ir pro chão. A luta tem que ficar no alto. Você só vai acertar ele se estiver de pé. Tem que ter muita atenção nesse round para evitar a queda. Se ele vier para cima e tentar te agarrar, não deixa de jeito. Ok, round two, you ready? You ready? Round two. The battle continues, and the champion is being pushed to the brink. The top contender looks very good, very calm, very poised, very determined to leave with the belt. Big punches. Nice combination. And he lands again. Man, some nasty body shots. And you can see the bruising starting on the left side. Great job blocking that punch. As we track the fight, we see the number of total strikes landing. Maya with a strong elbow to the head. He is doing some damage with these elbows. They are really battling for position in the clinch. Alves with the single leg takedown. He's back up. Man, he really turned on that inside leg kick. 
He's looking for a right hand, Mike. Alves with a strong front kick to the body. Look at this. Combination by the champion. Nice kicks. Big left hand by Damian Maya. That one hurt his opponent. Damian Maya, highly decorated jiu-jitsu practitioner, but ever-improving striker. Ah, oh, that punch was blocked by Alves. Nice punches. Trying to go to the body. Goes for a single. Alves with a solid leg kick. Tiago Alves is continuing to punish that one. Oh, he's he got rocked! Oh, my goodness! Vicious, vicious punch combinations here. He moves to stacking him now. Maya's got him in the plum clinch. And he hits a beautiful trip here. Elvis gets back up again. And he lands the punch. His left eye's closing up. Oh, head kick. Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. Joe, he continues to put together great combinations. That's a good kick to the body by Maya. 30 seconds. Late in the round here, and he gets the takedown. And he's in full guard. Joey's got his back now. That'll Wait. do it for round number two. Man, the champion landed some big shots in that round. It looked for a second like the fight was going to be over, like he would leave once again with his belt. Instead, the battle continues. Big power on this punch and results in a knockdown. You ready? You ready? Third round of this championship fight. Big front kick. Nice Nicely right done. Up Good uppercut. Up he connects on a nice combination. And another strike lands. Joe, I like how he used that switch kick. They are exchanging here, Mike. Maya gets caught by the inside leg kick. Head kick. Nicely done. Good block, straight count. Big knee right there. Wow! What a jab. Oh, and another one. That hurt him. Trying to take the back here. Now he's in full guard. He gets in a full guard here. He's going to get back up to his feet. Well done. Well done. Good roundhouse. Alves with some big kicks. That bruise on his torso is getting much worse. Hard leg kick. He's got the plum here. He's really doing a good job of controlling distance and getting off these shots. Past the midway point of our championship fight. Trying to pass. Oh, he gets reversed. Alves with the elbow to the head. And he's gonna try to take the back. There's a nice elbow. And he's got it in guard. Able to posture up and deliver some ground and pound. Elvis gets it to half guard. Man, that's just good ground and pound. Elvis with a big hammer fist. Just under a minute on the clock here in the round. 
Inside control. Beautiful reversal. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. He's back up again. That's a nice kick by Alves. He blocks the punch. He big scores left with punch. a huge left. Oh, that hooked it down. Good combination. Oh, man. Hard jab. Unbelievable. Respect yourself. Good right. three in the books. Damian Maya's nearly knocked out there. He was lucky the round came to an end. He certainly is lucky with the timing of that. He got hurt very badly at the end of that round. Charlie getting a set for round four. You ready? You ready? Let's we go. are in the championship round, the start of round number four. Joe, we have made our way to the championship round. The championship round is what really separates the good fighters from the great fighters. In the last 10 minutes of a fight, you get to see the work that the guys put in, in the first 15, and you get to see who pulls out ahead. That's a punishing hook from the clinch. Alves caught by that elbow. Now he's got the Muay Thai plum. His elbows have been his best weapon to me. Look at those numbers. Nice front kick to the body. Maya with the one, two. Man, the damage to his thigh continues to get worse. He's going to be walking with a limp for a while. Maya gets caught by the elbow. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. He's doing a really good job of timing these shots. Nice work in the clinch by Maya. There's another elbow. Looking for the single. Oh, and down. Just over three now. Back up. Maya's got him in the plum clinch. Oh, Tiago Alves is really building some momentum in this fight, Joe. He certainly is. The knockdown from the previous round has absolutely boosted his confidence, and you can see he's really on top of it tonight. Tagged him. Big front kick, Joe. Wow, what a great job mixing things up. Firing that left hand. Oh, that was a powerful kick to the body. He lands a huge elbow to the head. Nice takedown. On top in half guard. Joe, he's showcasing some great movement on the ground. And again, he gets back on his feet. He's got heavy leg kicks. Maya with the solid jam. Nice combination. Another powerful kick lands. Big straight punch. Powerful strikes. Oh, he's landed some good shots here. There he is. Got the takedown. Full mount. Nice slip. Another beautifully executed takedown for Damian Maya. Absolutely, Joe. His takedowns have been a huge factor. And he's back up again. He scores with the leg kick. Blood is pouring out of his face, Mike. This, this might be it. 20 minutes in the books, and that's the end of round number four. Here's a perfect head kick. What a great round. This fight is really... Fifth and final round of this championship fight. And it's very clear that the champion is behind on the scorecard. He knows he's got to earn a submission or a knockout. He's got to finish this fight or he's going to lose his belt. He's doing a good job of throwing punches and kicks from all angles here. Really doing a great job of mixing things up. Alves with a strong leg kick. 
Good takedown by the former top contender. Full guard here. Into half guard again. Oh, there, there he goes. He goes. Full there mount. Go. There we go. He's able to get back on his feet again. Straight to the body by Alves. Damian Maya's got the reach advantage in this fight, but he hasn't used it effectively. He definitely could be doing a far better job of utilizing his natural reach advantage and doing a far better job of placing himself out of range of his opponent's shots. Side control. Closing the distance, he's got the clinch, Joe. Good takedown defense, very nicely done. Joe, and another takedown, starting things off well here in this round. Attacking with the arm bar. Almost had the arm bar. by Maya, and now he's back in full guard. Back to half guard. Damian Maya is clearly losing this fight, so he needs to continue to look for that submission and try to pull off the victory. He needs a submission. He's not going to win a decision. There's no doubt about that. Maya looking to set that takedown up. Maya with a good straight. Great exchanges. One, two connects. Both fighters look absolutely exhausted at this point. Quick jab. That swelling on his eyes is really starting to get bad. Strong kicks by Alves. Good job of timing this combination of strikes here. Nice kick. Great job blocking the huge elbow. And there's that takedown attempt. 15 seconds remains. Vicious ground and pound by the challenger. They go the distance for the UFC belt. Now it's in the hands of the judges. Tiago Alves's constant pressure should be the key to him earning the decision. Absolutely, I think he was without a doubt the most active fighter in this bout. Here's a powerful punch that results in a knockdown. Round three, beautiful technique in this punch here, and it finds its way to the head. Round four, you gotta love the technique behind this takedown here. Beautiful trip. Round five, here we see the punch turn in and boom, find its way home. And here's Bruce Buffer Ladies with the official decision. After five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest, 48-47, 50-45, and 49-46. Declared the winner by unanimous decision, and new!